Hey guys, welcome to the SolidCam University channel. In this video, we'll be covering on how to add the ISCAR tool from the ISCAR tool advisor into your library. So what we'll do from right here is I just have my tool library open. I will come over to import and change the tab type to ISCAR. And it's gonna open up your ISCAR tool advisor. Let me just make this a little bit bigger here for us. And then just hover over the start and go to milling and go, or whatever tool that you're looking for. So what we'll do is we'll just do a facing right here and go ahead and click the link. Then what it'll do is it'll bring up um, basically this screen right here. You can pick your alloys of what you want. Um, you do have a drop down right here and you can pick what alloy you want right there. We'll leave what's, what's in there. Um, cutting depth, I'll just do 100 thou. Cutting width, I'll do 1.5. And we'll just click Find Tools. All right, it has pulled up a list of tools here, and you guys might have more or less, uh, depending on you know your search parameters right here. Um, so I have this cutter right here I can pick from. I have this Iskar cutter, or I have this one. Uh, basically, pick which one you want. So I'm going to hit the little checkbox right here. Then I'll come over here, and I want to download it as a zip file, and click the download button. And then you want to save it and go ahead and keep it in this location. Don't move it to a different location. Hit save. And now you'll see it automatically popped it up into my imported tools from my ISCAR. So if I wanted to bring that, that uh, face mill into my library, I can just click all. And now I can click on it and you'll see I have my ISCAR description right here. I got all my dimensions that are from ISCAR with everything set up uh, exactly how ISCAR had it uh, described in their manual. So this is how you guys can um, import the ISCAR tools from their website and bring them right into SolidCam. Any questions, please let us know and please subscribe for any tips and tricks inside SolidCam. Thanks guys, have a great day.